Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about one-step equations, and we're going to solve each equation. So, if I was given this equation, negative 126 equals 14k, okay? Well, negative 126 equals 14k. That 14k is just 14 times k, so opposite of multiplication is division. So I'm divided by 14 to both sides. And here's where it gets tricky. 14s cancel, I'm left with k here on the right. But I have negative 126 over 14, and I know that a um, negative and a uh, negative uh, divided by a positive is still negative. But I can't see necessarily, and long division really doesn't help in a sense here, I think, personally. And so, how can I see, break this down? Well, I like to see what each one, you know, I can break down what, you know, their prime factorization is. Well, 126, I just worry about the positive right now, 126, I know 2 goes into it, definitely. Well, 2 goes into 126 63 times. Hmm. Hmm. Well, 63 times, right? Is that right? Yeah, 6 and 3. Okay, 63. Well, doesn't 7 go into 63 too? 7? 7 goes into 63 9 times, right? 7 times 9 is 63. And I'm actually going to stop here. And why am I going to stop there? Well, I know 2 times 7 is at 14. So I know if I rewrote this out, the negative 126, I could rewrite to be negative 2 times 7 times 9 over 14. Well, 2 times 7 is just 14, right? So if 2 times 7 is 14, I can cancel these out right here, okay? Now, if you don't, you know, trust me, 14 is just 2 times 7, and we, you, know, you can see that right there, cancel it out. So 2 times 7 is canceled to the 14, so now I'm left with that negative, don't forget the negative that's there, negative 9. So negative 9 equals k. I can rewrite that nice and cleaner with k first. k equals negative 9. That is our final answer. So let's recap. We started with negative 126 equals 14k. I divided by 14 both sides because it's opposite multiplication. I then said, okay, the whole of 14's canceled. Just got k by itself. How can I break down 126? Well, I know 2 went into it 63 times. And then 63 was 7 times 9. And so now that set, I could keep breaking it down at that point, but I realized that 2 times 7 was 14. So I kind of stopped there, okay? So 2 times 7 times 9, all over 14. The 2 times 7 cancels with the 14 here in the division. So now we're left with negative 9. Don't forget that negative, right? And negative divided by positive is a negative. So we have negative 9 equals k. Rearrange it, so k comes first. So our final answer here is, is k equals a negative 9.